Basic Animation 3. With Photo Puppet you can make all sorts of animations. You can have puppets that rotate, move, or even react on movement. Let's practice some of this on our, on our Snowflake template. When you press the circle button on the toolbar, all objects on the screen will get ro rotation control buttons. Pressing the center button in the middle allows us to set the puppet's rotation movement, reverse it, or pause. Press the Track View button to bring up the track view. Scroll to the track containing your puppet and press Edit Track. The Edit Track window appears. You can now move the Auto Rotation Speed slider to change the rotation speed. You can use the Auto Rotation Mode buttons to pause or reverse the rotation. The Center Rotation Point button will set the point of rotation to the middle of the object or you can set it by tapping Rotating Object with two fingers, then the center of rotation will be set exactly between your fingers, like this. Let's say we want to make a car with rotating wheels, only this time the wheels will rotate when you move the car. We're going to create a new scene, add a background. Now, let's add the car's body. Now the wheels. First one. Then the second one. The tricky part is to attach wheels to a car. We do this by triple tap. This will set the attachment point. So let's attach these wheels. To make these wheels turn when you move your car, go to Track View, open Edit Track for the selected wheel and press Auto Rotation Mode with Vector Indicator on it. You can set the speed as well. Now repeat this step for the second wheel. See? A vehicle with turning wheels in 30 seconds.